You call this a path, Jose? One day, you say one day. Now two day walking, not just finish two days. Oh, it is a path. It's making me nervous walking through the jungle with a man who jumps out of his skin every time a twig breaks. Are you listening to me? That's a negative attitude. You gotta work on that and turn it around. Think positive, man. Believe in yourself. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hell, what's the use? Good, good. We're getting close. Whole scene. Let's go. I guess it's just you and me, little buddy. Get on in there. Get in there. RX4 to chain 16. Do you read me? I go home now. You are a very crazy man. We'll get killed. No, you don't go home. Listen to me, you little creep. One more hour, then we go home. Triple. Triple cash. I stay half hour more, OK? You're a thief, Jane. Okay. But you stay 45 minutes. You understand me? 45 more minutes. You know, signal then. I go home fast. You believe that thief? Hey, Grandpa, the boss wants you. Come on, Come move on, it. move it. Oh, boy, 20 minutes left, pal. We're not doing so well. And you're not much help either, considering we could be lost. No. Thomas W. Irving, special agent with the ISA. Undercover work in Hong Kong, Bangkok, and Rangoon caught snooping in Chiang Mai. Snooping with certain people, no doubt, would like to do me a lot of harm. Hmm? Go to hell. In time. Oh, come on, Thomas, you're an intelligent man. You know your life is finished. The question is, how slowly and how painfully? Why make your last moments so unpleasant? It's not so unpleasant. Well, that can't be right. Stay where you are! 
Let me hands. Hands up. Hands up. Hey, it, it wasn't me, boys. Well, sometimes he was a pain in the ass, but uh, basically we, we were friends. Go ahead, take it. It's yours. I don't need it. I, I'm tired of lugging it around in all this heat here. <laughs> hey, that's my buddy. That, I like you, too. Uh, careful with that and that. This is nice. Raw opium. The juice from one of these berries can literally annihilate pain. I can help people in pain, Tom. Oh, thanks. They'll see you for what you are. A disease. They'll wipe you out. Who will wipe me out? Who will wipe me out? You or this pretty young thing? We wouldn't want her to get the disease, would we, Tom? Leave her out of this. If you cooperate. She, she doesn't know anything. Leave her alone. She's just a kid. Then tell me. Tell me now. I don't know. I don't know. Ah! It's crazy, American. What does she think of me? Leaving me all alone? What am I gonna do here? I might get killed. He thinks I'm a fool, huh? Hey, friend. That's not any old watch, you know. It tells time, weather, compass direction. Hell, it's even got a radio in it. You don't believe me, do you? I can tell by the look on your face you don't. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'll show you. Well, I just want you to get the best out of my equipment. Better hear this thing, 16. You better be there, you little creep. No, no, too late. You made big trouble for me. Okay, four times, you thief. Okay, four times money, I come. Trust me, Tom. We'll look after her. What did they tell you? Was it Chu Chao? Can you remember? You can tell me, Tom. You can tell Nikki. Wu. Wu Mansu. Acetate. Wu. Acetate. Who else knows? Who else?
Nikki. Tom. Tom. Shit. You just had to go and do it, didn't you? You just had to try it by yourself. You okay, buddy? Hang in there, Tom, buddy. We're home free now. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Oh, Tom, buddy, I'm sorry, man. Truly sorry, buddy. Thanks. Yes, they're bringing him in now. Sir, I think I know my duty. Well, it's a welcome home party. I don't know what to say. Shut up, Queen. Sir Jim, hands on your head, Queen. Oh, it's not a welcome home party. Whatever you Shut say. Shut up, Queen. That's it. It's clean. Let me do it. I gotta hand it to you, Quint, and you had me fooled. Yeah, it's all fooled. Oh, yeah, I'm so smart, I don't even know what's going on. Keep your hands where I can see them. Oh, you fooled me all right, Johnny. God knows I would have trusted you with my own life. You still can. I don't know you at all. I don't know what kind of sickness it is that makes a man murder his partner. What, 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 what? Tom? Are you think? You're crazy. Am I? Irving is getting too close. I don't like it. Get rid of him. So how much is in it for me? Whatever you want, Mr. Quinn. Whatever you want. Well, that isn't me. That's the oldest trick in the world is to dummy a tape. That's no dummy. Steins was a drink mine. He got the tape. Yeah, I bet he did. And he pulled the wool right over your eyes with it. Watch your tongue, Quinn. 
legs. Are you that blind? You can't see Steins. He's behind all this. He's in with Corda. They dummied the tape to get me out of the way. They just stole something from me that'll prove it. That's all right, Max. When rats get hungry, they start eating each other. And right now, Johnny's starving to death. Well then, rat, you wouldn't mind emptying your pockets. You're pathetic, Johnny. Get him out of here. <laughs> Still somewhere around the building. Why don't we? Thank you very much. Keep the wheelchair. Take the hat, too. Where is he? The man who was in your cab, where is he? He much better. Take train. Give me fifty bucks, it's yours. Half a gram. That's what you get. No cash. Yeah. I'll shop around. Suit yourself. Yeah, one of your drivers picked him up at the precinct. That's right. A wheelchair. I'll wait. Fifty grams for the jacket. No, thanks. What are you doing down here anyway, huh? You don't belong down here. I know. You do. Ah. 
I don't need nothing from you, okay? place for a gutter rat to die in the sewer turn around i'm gonna give you as much chance as you gave my father mickey turn around i'm gonna give it to you in the back like you gave it to him is that what they told you but they lied i didn't kill your father he was set up by i know who set him up you no he was my partner he was my friend in my jacket if you just look in my jacket You'll recognize your father's writing. You've done your worst. And you're about to do yours. If you weren't such a big hurry to kill somebody, you know that. I'm not the enemy, Nikki. If you want to use that gun, you better be 100% sure. Otherwise, young lady, you just count yourself in with the rest of them. My jacket, the right-hand side, where you just look, the right pocket. tortured and killed because he got a hold of something very important. He kept a record of everything on a disc, a very small laser disc. They didn't, they didn't know what they were looking for until I showed up. Listen to me. I'm going to need your help to get it back. Nikki? The only help you'll get from me is a bullet through the heart. Here, here. Come on. Do it. Take it. You believe you're right. I'm part of everything that's wrong with this world, aren't I? Well, here, do it, do it, come on! Let's get out of here. Hold it right there! You're not going any place. Over there. That door? Yeah, go on. Over there. Well, you better make up your mind because they are looking for me and if they find me, you're never going to find out the real truth about your father. Okay, miss. We'll handle it now. It's all over, Johnny. Drop it. What? You heard me. Drop it. You heard her. Drop it. Steins. No, Steins, come back. Please. Give me the gun now. No. Back off. Back off. Back off. Give me that gun right now. Use a damn yes, thing. I do. Hold that right there, Gwen. Get down. You could point to think at them every now and then. I'd have a better chance if you'd stop breathing down my neck. Just don't forget who saved your skin back there. Thank you. Hell, he's not even armed. 
You promise? So? What are you gonna do now? I don't know. But I do know I'm gonna get that disc. Hey, wait! Oh, no, you don't. How do I even know you're telling me the truth? Well, why don't you just turn me in? Is this what you're looking for, Johnny? You should have left things alone, Johnny boy. Irving was a fool. Throw the disc over here. You stay out of this. So stupid, I told you to give me the damn gun. Don't move! I told you not to move. Don't move! Stay right there. Come here, you maniac! Why there's keepers, eh? All things come to those who wait. Give me the jacket. And the gun. I want the gun. Nikki, give him the gun. No. Give him the gun. It's my gun, not yours. Get off my back. Give him the gun now. You are a real pain, you know that? I keep getting you out of trouble, and all you can do is cramp my style. <laughs> what I want that stupid gun for? Ah, where'd they go? I had the jacket, man. There's a lesson there. Gentlemen, let me introduce to you the president of Ambrock International, Mr. Alex Cord. Gentlemen, I think you know why I invited you here. You wouldn't have come here unless you were attracted by the idea. The proposition I want to put to you is very simple and very lucrative. You're all successful businessmen. These days, government intervention and organized labor are shrinking the opportunities for big business. We are drowning in a sea of legislation, regulation, and high taxation. You're all well known for your willingness to take risks. You are not content to sit back and let governments and unions dictate the terms. You are entrepreneurs, initiators, Where are we going? We're not going anywhere. You got some place you could hide out for a couple of days? I'm not leaving there behind. Listen, kid, it's going to be a long night, and I got no time for babysitting. Oh, that's a laugh. You'd be dead twice over if it weren't for me. You can take off for all I care, but the disc stays with me. It belonged to my dad. I got it back. I want it. You don't even know what it is. He died for it, didn't he? It's the only way I can find out who killed him. Give it to me. Good luck, kid.
was thinking. Yeah, what? Well, it wasn't exactly thinking. It was more like... Like what? Would you just quit rushing me? I know you where... You got any money on you? No. I'm hungry. What is business when you take away all the rules and regulations? I tell you, gentlemen, the bottom line is supply and demand. So, gentlemen, I'm offering you unlimited demand. No controls, no taxes, and massive profits. I'm offering you the biggest growth industry in the world today. Narcotics. Mr. Corda, we're businessmen. We're prepared to take risks. There are certain obstacles. Customs officers, police forces, government agencies. There are rumors that even your organization has been penetrated by a government agent. Gentlemen, gentlemen, you underestimate me. Do you think I would have invited you here without giving you adequate protection for your investments? Let me introduce you to our insurance policy. I'd like to introduce Mr. Arturo Kendall, head of the International Security Alliance. You know, Tom never talked much about his family. See, I thought you were still a <laughs> younger. You and your father, were you, uh... Hell, anyway, Tom never talked much about anything. I'd only known him for about three months. Not even that, really. Uh, he was damn good at his work. I caught on to that quick enough. Did you know he was a loner? Serious. Took me long enough to get a feel about what the hell was going on. I wish he told me. I wish I'd been able to make him believe he could trust me. <laughs> uh, I've always had trouble making people do that. Let's face it, I have trouble getting people to trust me to tell them the right time of day. I guess it's just my effervescent nature. Good, Nikki. The... Nikki? the disc too. What for? Hey, are we partners now or what? Temporary partners. I still don't trust you. I need that disc. You sure it's okay to be in here? Yeah, he's a friend of mine. Then why are we breaking in? Just have it. Turn around real slow. And you will be... Shut up! <laughs> Johnny Quinn. I've been waiting for you to call the whole day. Where have you been? Well, I didn't want to lead him to you, wizard. What? You could have told me, you know. I thought you knew that. I thought you were smart enough to know. Quite right, quite right. I am endowed with unusual capabilities. So now I'm an accomplice of the corrupt Johnny Quinn. 
she corrupt too? Nah, she just keeps following me around. I can't get rid of her. Is that right, what he said? Uh... I have ways of making you talk, you know. Uh... I don't know. It's either you're corrupt or you're not. Which one is it, yes or no? No, I don't think so, no. Lucky you answer that. Very lucky. Otherwise, you'd be splattered all over the wall. Okay, Johnny. Give me the rundown. We're gonna hijack a plane to get you out of the country, right? No, not exactly. No, 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 of course not. That's a coward's way out, no. We'll uh, break into the state building and blow up the central computer. I don't think so. No? Well, what then? What, what's my assignment? A laser. Can you get a readout on something like that? A readout? That's it. That's my assignment. Well, yeah. Wizard, there's a lot of people who'd kill to get their hands on that disc. It's some dangerous stuff. It'll be coded. Do you think you could handle it? Can I handle it? Can a nightingale sing? Can Superman fly? I'll be right back. How long have you known him? Oh, a long, long time. Is he all right? Oh, yeah. I'm worried, Alex. Stop talking like a cop. Damn it, October. I raised $11 million tonight. 11 million is coming together like clockwork. By this time tomorrow night, all the cargo will be off the ship. The factory's already in production. In a matter of weeks, it'll be our product that's being sold on every street corner. Every syndicate and two-bit dealer will be working for us. We're on the home stretch, Arturo. Enjoy it. I can't enjoy anything while Janet Green's on the loose. He's unpredictable. Forget him. Stein's got the disc. Once that's destroyed, nobody can touch us. It's perfect. Hmm? <laughs> And here's where we do quality control. Ah, this is my most valued associate at Turu, Wa Man Su, my chief chemist. What? You fool. It wasn't my fault. You had him. Twice you had him. So did you in Burma. And Al Fox, your whole damned army. We're not dealing with just another run of mill operator. Quinn thrives on the impossible. What happened? These idiots of yours have lost the disc. My God. Then it's all over. Alex, we have to get out. Dismantle everything. Nobody's going anywhere. Alex, I have a family. You'll do exactly as I tell you. Diao Pak So Jing Lai. We're going to take care of Quinn once and for all. Since you're so frightened of Quinn. I'm not frightened of him. All I said... Since you are so frightened of Quinn, I'm loaning you back so, who is not one of your run-of-the-mill operators either. I'd use him wisely if I were you. Alphabet soup. Another strike out. She's gone off the rails. That thing has gone off the rails. She won't talk to me anymore. She, she's frightened. All I'm getting is word salad. Sure it's the machine that's out to lunch? If the cosmic computer had wanted everyone to see things in the same way, he would have written a different program, wouldn't he? Hmm? Wizard, what do they give people who go crazy? Amphetamines, uh, barbiturates, uh, depressants, it depends. Why? You want to give drugs to the computer? 
But what did the drugs do? How did they stop the word salad? Well, it's a filter. It blocks the electrical synapse, uh, like a wax spray on a car or a wax spray on a car. Oh, I'm so brilliant. Sometimes it terrifies me. They'd nail me to the cross if they ever suspected. I beg you both to keep our secret. Not a word to those cluds out there. Just let me bask unsung in my monumental superiority. Was that my dad? What does it mean? Obviously, the Chinese, uh, the Russians, they're planning to poison our water supply, right, Johnny? I'm gonna need your van, a gun, and some ammunition. Oh, a raid. So, uh, what's the plan? Storm the Bastille? Blow up the installation? What happened to my father? It's all right there on the screen. Damn you, you know I don't understand a word of it. I have a right to know. Okay, see if you can make sense of this. Corda stole a, a Chu Chow chemist, or he bought one, I don't know which. What's that? Chu Chow, it's the Oriental Mafia. It's the most powerful narcotic syndicate in the Southeast Asia. And that's how your father got involved. The Chu Chow gave him information to get Corda out of the game. So what went wrong? didn't know who to trust. He was given a list of names, Steins and Kendall. In his own mind, he could have thought I was part of it. So he went off on his own and he got caught. And this Corda, he killed Dad? Yeah. And anybody else who gets involved. The true child underestimated him. He's already got a power base set up right here in this country. He's got everything. He's got political protection, financial backing, all of it. But nobody can touch him. But we can. Ready. So am I. Now listen to me. I'm not going to any damn picnic. Both of you are going to stay here. Who's going to make me? Or me. Shit. Who took my styling moves? Mama, have you got my moves? I never touched this stuff. You enjoy looking like a freak? I told you to keep off the streets, didn't I? You're beginning to look like those animals out there. Are you listening, boy? Yes, Dad. I don't want you messing with that rubble in the south section. Now stand up. Turn out your pockets. Jeez, Dad, not again. I hope Alice didn't hear that. Who cares what Alice like? That isn't very nice, Max. You're giving the boys a bad example by talking like that. For heaven's sake, Louisa. He's already hanging out with punk louds. Don't confuse the issue. We're not finished yet. I want to see your room. Max, you're working yourself into a state again. I will thank you to keep out of this. Never mind, Alice. Just close your ears. OK, everybody remain calm. This is a, a, a kidnapping. That's a snake. It's a small oh, one. No, Get back. No, snake not easy, my man. Children. Max, I have something I want to show you. Ma'am, I just want to borrow your husband for a couple of hours. He'll be okay. Let's keep it friendly, Max. Should I make a thermos of cocoa? He likes his cocoa at tea time. Please shut up, sweetheart. Can we come? Now you stay here and take care of your mother. Alice wants to come too. You'll pay for this when I swear. Yeah, I usually do. If he tries anything... I'll splatter him all over the wall. That's right. Uh, you want to move over? I can drive. She can drive.
I just stepped on it here. Keep it straight. Another 10 years for accessory to murder. You're in a lot of trouble, boy. I know, I know. Been like that all my life. My father used to say I was nothing but trouble. Do yourself a favor. Put away that gun, and I promise you we'll go easy on you. Ah, that's real nice. Sorry, I can't promise you the same thing, though. What's that supposed to mean? Ah, that Johnny's become an animal. Chinese water torture, uh, electric shock, slow mutilation of the limbs. Ah, he's ruthless, that man. Baxu, Baxu, this is Briones. They'll be on the freeway in a couple of minutes. They're all yours. Okay. You shouldn't have done that. I want Quinn for myself. Have we lost them? They'll be back. Back there. Oh, we're getting to be good friends. Good friends. <laughs> ah! You've been lucky so far. But it won't last, Quinn. It won't last. I wouldn't talk him if I were you. I wouldn't. I've seen him skin a man alive for less. Layer by layer, he did. He, he, he kept the man alive for hours while he kept scraping away with his little pen knife. Hour after hour after hour, the poor fellow looked like a rhubarb pie before it finally croaked. <laughs> Turn left. Turn the car. Hang in there.
on. Somebody do something about this goddamn thing, you. Oh, no, not again. Ah! You looking for me? They got away, Max. That Johnny's on a lucky streak again. You bear a striking resemblance to your poor father, Miss Serving. I hope you value your life more than he did. I'm gonna kill you. You are like your father. What a pity. Leave her alone, Quarter. That's up to you. Now, where's the disc? I don't have it. One of your comrades in arms, perhaps. You're finished. I'm surprised the cops aren't here yet. Shall we stop playing games? Where is it, Quinn? Max has got it. By now, the whole world knows about you. Since you insist on playing games, I have one that is particularly interesting. Get these two out of here now! <clears throat> you just leave her alone. She doesn't know anything. Put them in the shower room. I want you and Stein to get a team together. Turn the city inside out if you have to do it. I want Gwyn's hide nailed to the wall. Strange. Where do you suppose this came from? Didn't he say something about a laser disc? He must have slipped it into my pocket of the house. Uh, probably a decoy he put together to throw us off the track. I get a printout. Now I want you to stay on the job. No more hitches. Just find him. I'll get Harris to take a look at this. Move! Galley slaves forever. I'm sure to get seasick. Crazy! Sir. I have no time for that. Come back tomorrow. Get me the chief, will you? Right away, of sir. Of course, right away. Tracy? He's on line one, sir. Arthur? <laughs> Sorry to bother you about this. But something's come up in the Irving Quinn case. What is it exactly, Max? A laser disc. Quinn claims that Irving uncovered some funny business in Chiang Mai. He'll probably come to nothing, Arthur. Quinn's a desperate man. He just walked cutting. I'll let you know more when I get the printout. You mean you actually have the disk? One of the computer boys is working on it right now. Why? Nothing. I just... Well done, Max. Your father was an idealist. He chose to die for his illusions rather than face the harsh realities of the world. You'll get nothing from me. My friends and I pride ourselves on our expertise in the application of pain. 
you shall be the recipient of our vast experience. No! In your case, we will reroute all the nerve centers to your eyes. The rest of your body will be paralyzed. When the needle is inserted into your eye, you will do anything to make the pain go away. You would kill your own father. There's got to be a way out of here. Oh, it's no use, Johnny. The place is watertight. It's going to be our dungeon for the rest of our lives. It's no good, Johnny. It's sealed in like a steel coffin. Uh, Johnny, we're not going to be cowards now, are we? You wouldn't consider just handing them over the laser now, would you? I don't have it. You can trust me, Johnny. Come on, I'm not going to be the one to tell them you've got it hidden in some secret part of your anatomy now, would I? I'm no coward, am I? You're the wizard, right? You're the wizard, right? Uh-huh. Well, there's a powerhouse up there. And right here, there's enough wire here to run a lead to the door. Like I was saying, if we keep calm, I can use my considerable intelligence to find a way to get us out of here, no sweat. How long do you think it would take? Don't rush me, don't rush me, Johnny. I'm an artist, not a mechanic. Jesus, it's the mother lord. Martinez. And step on it, love. It's urgent. Put it down, Joe. Gently. Lower, just beside the carotid. Alex, just be honest, he says it's important. I won't be long. Wizard, I'm gonna need a diversion. Why don't I go make a diversion? Sounds good. 
Where do we meet? I'll call you or have lunch. You're certain you got to them in time? Well, bring it to me now. Quinn and his friends are suddenly expendable. Get rid of them. And this time, be sure. Understand? That's right, you little freak. You all right, kid? You look great. You were right. What? I said you were right. I am just a kid. I never felt like that before. I'm really scared. Welcome to the club, kid. I want to get you out of here. Everybody on the pier, everybody on the pier. Sailors, civilians, men, women, children, and everybody else. On the occasion of the 15th anniversary of this shipping line, you're all invited on board for free food and drinks. That is free food and drinks.
Well, this takes care of the main problem. Quinn, I want the entire pier sealed off. Do you understand? Find out where Harris is. I want to see him in my office right away. Nothing can stop us now. Father called this his life insurance policy. Well, it wasn't entirely wasted, kid. Perfect. Okay. What we're doing is against the law. Without that disc, there's no evidence. There's nothing. Nothing at all. Do you understand that? Even if we're lucky. If we're lucky enough to get past quarters, men, we might all stay in jail the rest of our lives. Do you understand that? I understand that the law is going to let that scum spread even more poison around. If that's the law, I'm against the law. Wizard? Heck, Johnny, you know me. If I stopped to think about it, I'd never get out of bed. It's a raid, right? Right. We're the good guys, right? Well, I hope so. Well, let's get on with it, eh? I'm a fool. Want you? I'm a fool to want you. Get down here and take your clothes off. I've seen you before. Uh, it's like that all the time. I must have a real forgettable face. <laughs> Bad luck for me. You got a pass? Yeah, sure I got a pass. You got 10 minutes to get your load off and be out of here. You get that? I bet you I can do it in five. <laughs> The 
This is just the beginning, Mr. Pirelli. I look forward to a very long and mutually prosperous relationship. Tear for a cigar. Thank you. You know, you come with quite a reputation, Mr. Corda, but we shall see. People are very easy with words. But in the end, it's the result that's most important. Capiche? I would prefer if my brother could do it. Of course. Bruno. No, not that one. Pick another one, Bruno. I admire your thoroughness, Mr. Pirelli. Well, if I don't take care of things, who else will? My sentiments, exactly. Just like he said, the best quality. 95% pure. Maybe higher. Ben, you are a man of your word. We have a deal. Indeed we do. It won't be long before those guys find out we pulled the fast one on them. The alarm could go off any minute now. You just make sure you get those explosives in place. Good is done, but I'm gonna need time. Well, we'll try to buy you something. You get going. Okay. Bruno! Wait, 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 wait. I'll
time you're ready. Where do you think you're going? Oh, get back! Get out of here! Oh. What are you going to do? You let them get this far. Deal with it. You think he's still on his own? Sounds like he's got a whole damn army with him. He's only human, for Christ's sake. Well, let him come to us. He won't stand a chance, right? Get in the car. Alex, you gotta take me with you. He's gonna kill me, Alex. No, I don't believe he will. Where's Corda? He's in there. Dead. Splattered all over them. Well, Gwen, you've created one hell of a mess out here. 
<laughs> yeah, I guess I have. Feel good about it, I bet. Probably expect a commendation. Hey. Help this man to my car, now! Where's my key? What key? The key to my house. I gave it to you before we left. No, you didn't give me a key. I did. No, you didn't give me the key. I did. How do you expect me to get in hey, without Nikki, my key? I'm wounded here, OK? I don't know anything about a key. So what am I going to do now? Nikki, I don't, I don't know anything about it. Be serving. <clears throat> I have to talk to a man about a missing key. 